dear uh, economics aspirants right now i have the indian system of medicine this subtopic will subtopic will come under indian economic development infrastructure and health when you study the indian economic development infrastructure then you will get the indian system of medicine ism so it includes six systems ayurveda yoga yunani siddha naturopathy and homeopathy it is known as the ayush at present there are 3943 ayush hospitals and 27700 dispensaries as and as many as 7.4 lakh registered practitioners in india but little has been done to set up a framework of standardized education to, to promote research. ISMs have huge potential and can solve a large part of our healthcare problems because they are effective, safe and inexpensive. So here you will see you ISM and what stands and what stands uh, Ayush. Indicator of health and health infrastructure when uh, critical appraisal. As pointed out earlier, the health status of a country can be assessed through indicators. Any any country any country which bears the indicators such as infant mortality and maternal mortality rates, life expectancy and nutrition level. These are the indicators along with the incidence of communicable and non-communicable diseases. Some of the health indicators and India's position are given in table 8.4 when you study the 8.4 and you will get uh, the Indian China China US and Sri Lanka what is the status of India in terms of China and the US and Sri Lanka data is uh, uh, data belongs to 2015-17 datum of India and datum of China datum of USA so data are here uh, here you will see the scholars argue scholars argue that there is there are greater scope for role of government in health sector for instance the table solves expenditure on health sector as 4.7 percent of the total gdp you will see here 4.7% of total GDP. This is, this is, uh, uh, by Smalley, low as compared to other countries, both developed and developing. Here is the developed and developing country. You will see here. One study points out that India has about 17% of the world's population about but it bears a frightening 20% of the global burden of disease uh, that is the GBD. GBD is an, is an indicator used by experts to ga gauge to gauge the number of people dying per prematurely due to a particular disease as, as well as the number of years spent by the them. In a state of disability owing to the disease. In India, more than half of GBD is accounted for communicable diseases such as diarrhea, malaria, and tuberculosis. Every year, around 5 lakh children die of waterborne diseases. The danger of AIDS is also looming large. Here, you will see the malnutrition and inadequate supply of. Uh, Vaccine leads to the death of 2.2 million children every year. At present, less than 20% of the population utilize public health utilities. One study has pointed out that only 38% of the PHCs have the required number of doctors and only 30% of the VSC have the efficient stock of medicines. Urban, rural and poor rich divide will be our next course of action. We will meet in the next session with a lot more. Till then, thank you. Thanks for watching the video.